talking about it today. Mr. Pasco realizes yes. it's something that needs to be looked at as well. The ones your attorneys are working, are you sending a draft to the community? So uh, what I was hoping, if it's done for next Thursday, it'll be presented at our board meeting next mm -hmm. Thursday. Um, we'll get uh, gather um, feedback from the municipal leaders. Um, and then from there, I would assume it would go to each municipality, uh, to their attorney. We are going to have an, a different uh, one of the community attorneys look over and also just to maybe identify some key concerns so we're not bouncing these back and forth 50 times. But at the end of the day, you know, Mr. Sweat would get it to review on your behalf and everyone's uh, appointed solicitor would be. Um, Thank you for saying that. Is, there's a resolution um, with Jefferson Hill Ambulance, or excuse me, Jefferson Hill Council. And Doug could probably speak more to this, but um, they have a resolution allocating a portion of their real estate taxes to EMS. Is Jefferson Hill Borough does, yes. Okay. So is, is that just a flat uh, rate that goes from the taxpayer? It, it's a millage that goes to the borough, and then they send us that check on around November, and then they've agreed to give us a makeup check in December. So if they're take 50 ahead to us, let's say 135,000 a year, I believe is where they're gonna be at, somewhere around there. We'll get about 70 in millage okay. and the rest will come from general funds. Just keeping up with sense to see how they did it. Did they raise their millage rates on the taxpayers? To fund not them? yet, they did not wanna raise taxes last year, so it's general fund money. Okay, but that's not sustain, I obviously say that. How do you sustain that board? I mean, you're, you're gonna to have to look at that long term or can i ask is other communities looking at raising the residents taxes i i'm not aware of any ones that are um to be honest with you i'm not aware that any of them are doing that uh but i honestly haven't asked them all where they're coming up with the money they just asked when do you want it as well they said most of them almost all of them want to wait until november when the majority of the tax money's in okay. mr Costa, may i ask a question mm -hmm. when you said that they didn't raise their taxes you mean to make up the difference or initially when they put that in? Well, when they first put it in, they were, they raised that tax raised millage. It. Right. Right. So right. That but millage, since then, our, our millage has never been adjusted up. Right. But they didn't take existing and shift it to you. They raised it to give you a portion. And then they're not raising it again that you know of to close the Correct. Case. Only Jefferson. That's the only one I'm aware of. I just wanted to clarify. Thank so you so much. Would the board be interested in having Terry research how much they raised the mills in Jefferson just to see? That's a phone call, I would think. So after the workshop, I I mentioned that because Medical Rescue Team South is a public authority, did anyone go on the website to actually look at their budget and how much would the new use actually pay for this? Sure. Yes. Oh, no. Did you? I, I relied on the, um, we did a right to know. Is that what you mean? Or no. The, no, so we're, so that of course Keep South is a public authority, okay. uh, you know, uh, an authority. So we're governed by, we're a municipal government. We're governed by the communities we, we run. And on our website, there's actually a section okay. where you can actually look at our budget because we are a government agency. And you can actually see how much our communities actually pay for our services. Right, okay, and you're in Allegheny County. That, that is in Allegheny County. Okay. Okay. But, Thank you. But they're the closest organization other than the city of Pittsburgh that you will be able to find that type of information. We're, we're equally the size of what Serums is. Okay. So our our expenses are going to be close to what their expenses are. Have you seen that in Township in Allegheny County where they're raising millage rates to uh, be able to pay? I, know, I do know that every service in Allegheny County that is close to the South Hills their communities all pay some portion of money to their agents. So you can look at Bethel Park for how much they pay in the tri-community. You can look in Mount St. Clair or South Park. You can look in the serums now that they're actually receiving money from their communities. Baldwin, EMS, and how much they're getting. So that you have to actually look at the municipal budgets to get that information. Right. <coughs> Thank you very much. You're welcome. Okay, so in the resolution to Jefferson Hill, they also talk about an ambulance tax account and which they separate how much money is given per year. Um, the distribution is in October. 
Um, they also request from CIRMS an annual preparation um, of expenditures. Doug, is that correct? Do you do some type of an audit? For we, you? we give them all uh, 990. That's what we give them. We give them our annual tax returns. Okay. Thank you. So these are all things just, I, I think this is, uh, you know, it needs some more attention and uh, conversation to make sure it's being done properly. Any other questions or thoughts? Well, that's very, very helpful there, what you're saying. Okay, is everybody done with that discussion? Number six? Yes. Item number seven, approved and I changing EMS service to first response medical service. I would like to make a motion to deny changing EMS service to um, first responders, emergency, and or whatever the name is. Could somebody repeat the name for me? First response medical services. First response medical services. Okay. Let's see what they're going to do for us, folks. Please stop disrupting the meeting. Ms. Evans Warren, could you please stop disrupting our meeting? Okay, any seconds to Ms. or Supervisor Dupree's motion? They don't care. They don't care. Okay, motion dies. 